Greetings, welcome to Sci-Fi Test Lab, where we create action-packed experiments based on our favorite sci-fi movies. I'm Zaire, and my co-host Sky is nowhere to be found. Sky? Sky? Please don't ah! scare me. Today is all about raptors from Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom. We're gonna build a claw machine, but not the kind that gently lifts stuffed animals. Nope, the kind that tears animals to pieces. It's time to see what's science and what's just fiction on Sci-Fi Sci Test Lab. I like your mask, by the way. What mask? Huh? Ah! No! Ah! Velociraptors use their massive toe claws to stick through prey and pin it down before eating it. <laughs> Ever heard of a fork, you dinosaurs? It's gonna take some ingenuity to make a claw this powerful. I already sketched this design. And in Jurassic World, Blue is the coolest Velociraptor there is. She was genetically engineered to show empathy and even helps Owen and Claire save the day. Hey girl, you miss me? I wish I had a dino buddy. No more getting picked last in gym class, that's for sure. Hmm. I'm not really sure how to make this claw slam down. Let's check in with our sci-fi scholar, Derek from Veritasium. Hey guys. Hey, how's it going? I hear we are talking velociraptors today. Yeah, but we need some help with the mechanics. Hmm, well here's a fun fact about velociraptors. Their name actually comes from Latin, meaning swift thief. Oh, that's cool. A, a little random, but cool. Oh yeah? Another fun fact? Their jaws had the bite force of 8,000 newtons. That's roughly the equivalent of a large alligator today. Ooh, should we recreate a raptor bite? Nah, my favorite part of the raptor is the claws. Rah! Sky, don't attack our guests. Sorry. You guys have a high powered machine. So here's what I'm thinking. If you mount a metal arm on that machine with a claw on the top, and then you pull from the bottom, it'll snap down like a catapult. <sighs> That's perfect. Let's get started. So to make the raptor claw, we start with a claw image in our computer-aided design software. Using that image, we cut three metal claw pieces along with a metal base plate to attach them. In order to do some serious damage with this claw, we need to create a catapult motion. To do this, we mount the claw on a metal swing arm attached to the frame of our pneumatic ram system. Voila! Seraptor. Whoa! That looks amazing. This looks like the ultimate back scratcher. Time to see what this robo claw can do. A first gummy bear. Ouch! Ooh. Wow, the claw broke the TV, but couldn't shatter the glass. That's because the glass is curved. The curve makes the glass stronger. Yikes, our raptor claw sure knows how to shred. Ah! Come on, you know blue makes me nervous. Hey Zaire, what is a raptor's favorite type of music? Um, rap music? Nope, river dance. Well, I'm no longer scared of blue. Thanks to Derek from Veritasium for all the help. We'll see you next time on Sci-Fi Sci Test, Test Lab. Lab. Ah!
Click here to see more Sci-Fi Test Lab. And click here to subscribe. And make sure to check out Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom. Or I'll eat you! Rawr. Watch out, Zaire! Rawr. Rawr.